Hey everyone, GoBots here, back today with a brand new episode for Madden 20 franchise with the Dallas Cowboys here in week 16. The division's locked up. The NFC race for the number one seed is not. Of course, we are still the number one team in all of football at 12 and 2, but the Saints are right behind us at 11 and 3, and if we happen to lose this game when they win against the Titans, then that will flip us. We'll go from 1 to 2. So there are stakes in this game. We have made a few adjustments today. Uh, we're still playing Cooper as our starting guy out there. We're, we're keeping all these guys the same. Uh, Zeke still going to toke the rock, at least in the first half for us. Defensively, though, we have brought in Robert Quinn to start. He, again, he's two overall worse than Crawford. And we also are put Lawrence down uh, in, in favor of Armstrong. We'll see if that stands for much because there's always formation subs that get in the way. But the reason for this, Crawford, again, 80 overall, 29 years old, uh, star potential. Okay, so they're, they're, that's why he's been starting all year long. Uh, then you look at Quinn, 78 overall, same age, star potential. So they're basically the same player, the same position, uh, which is why Crawford's been playing for us the whole year long. Um, now we're going to give Quinn his due. He's going to get his chance today for us. But let's jump into this game again. I thank you all so, so much for joining in for another Cowboy episode. If you enjoy what you see here today, uh, make sure to hit that notification bell thumbs up button first of course uh let's actually let's make custom let's go custom jerseys today let's wear our homes pants let's i want to wear the whites yeah white white Ooh, i like this i like that set of jerseys right there we're gonna wear that do they have all like a all green Ooh, all black i like that too so we're gonna make them wear those we're gonna stick with that but again let's hit a like goal today of 85 likes on today's videos. Comment down below with your prediction for today's game. Also, know this. I put this on. It's on my community tab on the channel. Uh, if you go to my channel, you go to community tab. I have a poll there. I am uh, maybe about to start a fantasy football league on you ESPN. The GoBots Gaming Fantasy League. Uh, and with that, it's a free league. There's no money up for grabs. There's nothing like that at all. It's completely for just fun, competition, uh, as a community. But it's... The league, the maximum number of players you can have is 20. So if we have more than 20 participants that are interested in doing it, we may have multiple leagues going. Uh, but a great day game here today against the Eagles. But uh, know that that is in the works. Stay tuned for more news on that. But let's get into this. It's a cold day, they say. And we're going to jump right into this game today, man. Nice, beautiful day here from Lincoln Financial. The home of the Eagles. And we need to get this win. Uh, I don't know what the Saints score was. I think they already played their game. I think they were one of the early games. So we're, we're kind of holding out to see if the if the Saints won. If they won, we we, ha we have to get this win here today. Uh, so I mean, starters in. We got to get this win. We got to lock up that one seed. If they lost, we kind of have the you know capability to play a little bit more loose. So we're kind of playing by ear, seeing how that game went. We'll see. And first carry there. And there's their line. Who cares? Okay. Uh, second and six. Also, there's going to be some new content coming on the channel soon. I uh, had some very awesome people that are commenting saying, go watch, you know, you don't always have to only play sports games. And I love my sports games. I love playing these games for you all. Uh, but I do want to play other stuff and get that on the channel as well. So, like, Apex Legends just started solo mode, so look for that coming soon. Also, uh, I've been playing a lot of the Hunt Showdown. Hunt Showdown is a really underrated game that was made by Crytek, uh, people that did Crisis. So look for that content as well. But playoffs coming soon on this channel. With this, playoffs are happening right now in our Texas Rangers franchise. Lots of exciting stuff happening right now on this channel. We gotta wrap up that one seed. We gotta wrap up that one seed. Play action, get the sack. Oh, fumble, Brown, go! Yes, sir. And Brown leaps into the end zone on the fumble. We got the strip there from Demarcus Lawrence, who I didn't think was supposed to be in the game today, but he is. And we get the wit we get that to start us off right there. A uh, scoop and score by Brown. Dallas leads. All right. So after the scoop and score, we got a little bit of a wind here to worry about. But we're up and through. Is a seven nothing lead. 
And New Orleans did in fact win 34 to 7 against the Saints, uh, or not the Saints, against the Titans. So that means we, we unfortunately we do have to keep some starters in at least until we get a comfortable lead, and uh, knowing that we need to stay stay true. And that means even week 17 maybe. And week 17, I'm not taking the risk. I'm probably sitting most of my starters. We're just gonna have to go try to get the game done with the backups. But as far as this game right now, we're keeping everything in. Lawrence, why are you still in the freaking game, man? I put you as the number two. Whatever. I'm not going to lose sleep over it. We need his aggressiveness off the end anyway. So, New England, I think, just locked up their division over there against Buffalo with a win. Trips bunched on the, tight, on the left side over here. Single back. Smallwood going right, and he's taken down there by Jalen Smith. Look at that score for the Rams, 48-45 to over San Francisco. That's an upset win there for the Rams, defeating the division-leading San Francisco Giants. That may disrupt some stuff. Uh-oh, nothing going there for you, man. Brought Brown off the end. He's having a good game so far. Tackle for a loss and a scoop and score. Cowboys up 7-0. Here's a third down and nine for the Eagles. Oh, crap. He's open middle of the field, middle of the field. And we got him for a loss. Or not a loss. We got him behind the yards, the, the, the line. Yes, good, 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 good. No first down. They got to punt the ball away. Tavon Austin back deep to receive it. And we're going to let that go. And it goes out at the 29. Not a very good punt. And here comes the leader of the Cowboy offense, Dak Prescott. QB1 coming out. Lead. Looking to maybe uh, potentially get a 3,000 or 4,000 yard season. We'll see if he can have that type of performance through the air today. But we're not going to start through the air. We're going to start with Tony Pollard on the blunt dive. Left side. Pollard competing for rookie of the year. Don't think he'll get it. Um, he got one, but he didn't get any. Oh, so it's a no gain there on first down. And we're going to go to the trail here. Cooper man coverage out there on the left side. And Cobb caught. Got eight. Brings up a third down and one. All right, third and one. Oh my God! And he gets down the midfield just about. First down, Dallas. Cleveland with another big win. Now Cleveland may be that team we face off in the Super Bowl if we happen to get to the Super Bowl. It's not a gimme. We know that. If I if I could make my predictions on what I would like to see happen come postseason football time for Dallas in this game, I want a redemptive storyline. I want to get to the postseason in the NFC Championship. I want the Cowboys to defeat. The Saints, who defeated us early in the year. And then, if we make it to the Super Bowl, I would like to go against the Patriots and defeat them and get our redemption against them. Um, so that's kind of the way I'd like it to go. We get sacked. Sweat comes in, and he knocks the sweat off the brow there of Dak Prescott. They're down now. Oh, baby. Come on. Wide open. Give me the block. Save on Austin. Good stuff. Good stuff. I, I noticed that the corner stayed under, left uh, Tavon wide open down there. First and 10 now at the 23-yard line. Cowboys up early. We're going to follow our blockers. Pollard in the end zone. Touchdown, Dallas, baby. Dude is having a really good rookie year. First touchdown for him on the day. How about him, man? Fourth touchdown for him rushing this year. Not happening. Wow. So, chance to make it 14 nothing here before the game even really gets started. And there we go. So, the Dallas offense and defense clicking here early in this first quarter. Now, we've, we've said this all before. Again, last week when we played the Rams, we jumped out there early. 21 to, what, 3 or 7 or something. And then that game got kind of tight. So, uh, I'm going to keep my mouth shut and not get too cocky because we all know what happens if that happens. So, this game can flip. And real quick, Curry. Madden has a way of doing that. We all know this. If you're a Madden player, you know Madden has a way to make the game a little interesting. First and 10 now here for the Eagles. And 
and he's just gonna let that one go out of bounds. First incomplete pass for Carson on the day. Second down and 10 now. Collins and Quinn in the game now. Quinn getting that start. Again, he's not in every formation, but he's in quite a few, and he caught that first down there. Jones there for the stop, but he got the first down before anything else happened. Bet they go on the ground here. Yep. And nothing going to happen there for you. Shane Ray on for the stop. Dallas is left outside back. A lot of times he will come down and be a defensive lineman for it, just like right now. Uh, he's done a pretty good job for us this year. I've been very pleased with his performance as a free agent coming in for us this season. And, oh, my God. Another chance at a turnover there for Brown. He just put a hand on it, though. That falls incomplete. Third and nine. Trips tight on the right side here. Interesting. And tipped by Jalen Smith. He got a hand up and deflected that ball down. Fourth and nine. They got to punt the football away. Dallas will take over. Let's go, baby. All about beating the Eagles. All about defeating our dang division opponents. You know, get, let that, oh, shoot. And I, I shouldn't have returned that, but he stuck it down on the map. That's all right. Here comes Dak. Here comes Coop. And Ooh, Cooper, you may be the man on this play. There we go. There we go. First down for Coop. Just keep chipping away at Cooper, trying to get him to get more and more stats. Making up for that lost time with him on the shelf this year for, what, five, six weeks it seemed like? Jarwin breaking a tackle. Jarwin wanting to compete next year for the top spot in the tight end uh, spot for the Cowboys. Again, if you didn't know, uh, Dak, or not Dak, Jason Whitney offered him a contract. He turned it down and said he wanted to test free agency, which is uh, surprising to me, yes. But we'll see what happens with him if he goes somewhere else or if he does indeed retire after the year. But uh, Witten's done. He's done with the Cowboys after this season. So that means tight end position is up for grabs between Jarwin and company. We may go after somebody free agency. We may go after a draft pick. We'll see. Oh, I... I misread you, Mr. Number 50, whatever you are. Misread you completely on that play. Go inside zone here with Tony Pollard. My, 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 maybe my biggest surprise player this year that I'm just loving watching him play. He's just been so much fun. Just the way he's developed throughout the season and everything he's done. We are really going down that safety. Ooh. Wide opens B, and I couldn't get the pass off, and that's going to be a big fail. It's a big fail there. We took a chance on that third down play, and we got to punt the ball away. Come on, pin them. Pin them. That's a good punt. That gets out at the nine. I'll take that with Jones. Good punt there from Jones. But let me know down below, y'all, what... Do y'all think, what would be your the games you want to see the Cowboys? Who, who do you want us to beat in the NFC Championship if we get there? And who would you like to see us go up against in the, uh, the Super Bowl if we happen to make it there? So leave all that down below in the comments. I told you mine. Again, I want redemptive storyline. I want to be able to go back and beat the Saints in the NFC Championship and defeat the Patriots in the Super Bowl. If that is the way it goes, that'd be just perfect. That'd be like a perfect story to tell here in the first season. Uh, the two teams that beat us, we can go up and beat them. Now, give me, there's still, you know, a chance that we could lose some games. I mean, we may not get out of this game alive. We may not get out of Washington, our last home game. Let's see. Let's see. Uh-oh. Good play. Brown. Miami with their second win on the year, y'all. 24-13 over Cincinnati. How about that? Good job, Dolphins. 19 seconds left in the quarter. Cowboys up by two scores. Slant, and shy of the yardage, and Deshaun Jackson is injured. That will stop the clock, so they got to make another play happen here. Play action. He beat us deep. 
And, uh, we got lucky because they didn't take a shot downfield on us. They beat us deep. So that's the end of the quarter. Cowboys lead this thing 14 0. Deshaun, Deshaun Jackson went down with an injury there at the end of that quarter. And we'll see if he gets back in this game. Right now, he is not. First and 10. Whoa, he moved. Number 19 moved. Oh, he dropped it good. Tough play. He dropped it. Some of the fans here don't seem too happy about mm -hmm. the cover four palm. I mean, it's a cold day here from Philly, but it is nice and sunny, which is nice. Oh, man, good play right there from Jones. Get a hand on it, second deflection in as many plays. Third and ten. Good to him. Oh my god, a huge hit from Jeff Heath, but he caught it in the red zone down to the 10, first down to 10. He, he got he got separation. He got separation on us right there. Oh man, come on, come on, come on. First down and 10. And nope, Smallwood may have regretted going up for that ball. He may regret it going for that ball because that he got absolutely hammered on that play. Second and ten, will they run it? Nope, another pass. Breaks one tackle, gets down to the five or six. Bring up a third and six, third and five. From the six yard line, let's see what happens here, man. They're looking for their first points on the day, tied in the set on the right. And over the middle. Down to the one. Did they get any downs? First and goal. Wow. So they didn't get enough for the touchdown, but they got enough for a first down. How about that? No, why am I doing it? Oh, he rolled out. Okay. That's perfect. That's perfect. Get the sack. Good. Deflected it. Your biggest worry? Right. Let's see. Gotta get to him. Gotta get to him. Shoot. Well, there they are. They're in the end zone. And the Eagles are up here with a touchdown. Now 14-7 Cowboy lead if this PAT is good. And of course it is. They never miss those. All right. We're in a ball game, y'all. The Eagles will not lay down quietly. Ah. Down to the 22. Should have taken the knee. That's all right. Um, let's go back with Pollard. Being outgained 150 to 101. Oh, my God. Tony Pollard, ladies and gentlemen, the rookie sensation <laughs> for the Cowboys. I mean, I, 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 mean, I mean that, too. I think he's just so undervalued. Ah, Zeke not getting it going right there. Three of 19 now. That's all right. We'll go with this. We'll go look at Gallup on the end route here. Look at Gallup on the end route if we got time to throw. We got to have time to throw this ball. Oh, no, he jumped the route. I threw it too early. He threw it too early. That's a big, that's a bad play. That's a bad play for me. I'm going to try not to stress about it. Forget about it, if, especially if we can hold them not getting a touchdown here. We can't let them get a touchdown here. I prefer to get a turnover, though. Dang it, man. Why did, I, why did I get so... I got in a hurry. I mean, again, I felt the pressure coming into the pocket, and I got in a hurry. And play action. Rolling left. Wide... Oh, my God. No. The game is finding a way. I mean, obviously, I gave this gift to this team. I, I gave them the opportunity with that pick, and I shouldn't have thrown that ball. I knew better. Stand them up there, Van Der Esch. We're going to make them kick a freaking field goal and keep this lead. Make them kick the freaking field goal. Oh, 
Oh, just, no. Okay, good. No catch. No catch. Third and goal. Third and goal. Can we stop you? Wide open. Slant. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Well, he's back from his injury. We're now tied after this PAT. It's all right. Little advised pass by Dak Prescott. Leads to a touchdown there from Wentz to Jackson. And uh, Cowboys got to value the, value the possession, value the lead, and not try to play too quick. Uh, case in point, what just happened, we just saw. Gone. All right, Zeke, get it going, man. Keep going. Got three, broke a tackle, couldn't get going anymore. Go back to the tight end here. Second and seven for Dallas. Jarwin gets the edge. Good job there from Blake Jarwin. Good job. Right, let's go slants here. Caught by Michael Gallup. I thread the needle right there. I got it through. Oh, they got the outside backer right there. I don't know if I like it. That was a nice yeah, run slant route, and what the receiver is trying to do is make the defender think he's going up field for a deeper route. Well, they shifted. Oh my God! Okay, well that was a mishap on my part. The whole line shifted, and uh, obviously that didn't work out to our advantage. Second and twelve now. Wow. We need the time to throw. We'll get it. Gallup with another big catch for Dallas. There we go. It's a hole, and there is 10. Second and inches for Dallas. Come on. Fall for the pump. Fall for the pump. Fall for it. Fall for it. Oh, he didn't fall for it. But we got what we needed, so it's okay. First down and ten. All right. Bring a Cooper all the way over. And oh man, we almost got it. We followed all our blockers over. We almost got exactly what we needed. Second and goal. At the two, Zeke, please don't get hurt on this play. Please don't get hurt on the play. Thank you. Dallas touchdown. Taking back the lead. Number 11, they say, hey. Perfect accuracy. And that's money. 21-14, Cowboys regain the lead here with 3.55 left in the half. In a battle right now with the Eagles on the road in week 16. In a battle. They're not going to return that one. All right, so this will bring out the Eagle offense. Uh, they've been, been playing good lately. They've been, they've been playing a lot better. Carson Wentz and company have been doing their thing. But we're going to try to slow them down now here as we've retaken the, the trend in yards gained. Play action rolling out. Deep pass coming down and they're going to throw it out of bounds. Nobody going to get that but the scrubs on the sideline. Tripping the bunch on the left side. Oops. The comeback route caught. It's okay. Rolling down our free safety. Heath's going to take over deep thirds on the left side. The middle of the field, excuse me. Going back out. Okay. So no run play coming here. 
And a short little drag route right there caught by Ertz. Second and eight. Trips on the left. The right. Shoot. Well, Smallwood. Ten rushes, 37 yards, and a touchdown today. And uh, right there, big, big 16-yard run. Gives the Eagles the first down. I hope they're not doing an RPO out there, that guy. So two-minute warnings here. Two minutes left now in the half. Cowboys up by touchdown. And uh, we're going to bring a blitz first play. And we're going to hope it pays off. I, I hope this pays off. We're bringing the blitz. Nope. They got a game. It's not a first down. Clock is moving. Empty backfield here in the gun. Hot first down there. Boy, Ertz. Good man coverage, I guess. They beat me with a slant. They beat me with the dadgum slant again. God almighty, man. He's killing me with that play. And here we are again. Hot. Nope. I mean, it, that's so hard for me to cover. So hard for me to cover when he's just playing the way he is right now. And we're even again. Eagles will not go a heck away. They will not go away. I got to win, man. I can't let the Saints get the upper hand. Blockers to nothing. Okay, 45 seconds left in the half. Cowboys have all three timeouts left in a tie game. And uh, with this situation, I don't want to try to do anything too much. I certainly want to get down the field, but I don't want to throw a pick or anything stupid out there. And I could get a pass off. So that's that. Uh, we're going to definitely just take this in the half pretty much now. Bad gun. Well, Dalton. Uh, Where's the timeout? Well, that sucks. We're going to go play action power row. 16 seconds left in the half now. Dalton with a catch for Dallas. I'm calling a timeout, man. That play works so much. It's such a good play. Well, we're going to take a shot downfield and see if we can get in field goal range. If not, that's fine. We're going to take one, though. And that will take us into the half. Fletcher Cox with his third sack of the game. Cowboys going to go to halftime. Tied up. 21 all. And uh, this game is turning out like I wanted it not to turn out. I wanted to beat them handily, and it's not happening. Not happening. Not happening down to the 24-yard line. I'll bring up the Cowboy offense. And we're going to ride the back of our running backs to start off the second half. As the Eagles have woken up. Good run there from Zeke. Ninth rush, 47 yards. Second and four. Nothing good happening there. Good lord. It's a gain of one. Bring up a third down and three now. They're looking to bleed that blitz, it looks like. They'll play action on third and three and see if we get the time to throw. Wide open is Witten. Witten shrugging off one, man. God, he's so good. It's unfortunate he's not coming back for us next year in the game. He's, you know, whatever it is, but uh, we'll live. We'll make do. Okay, we'll make do. What is that? 
heavy pressure right out the gate, man. I couldn't even get the pass off. Well, that sucks. Uh, dang. Okay, well. Woo! Oh my god, Cobb! What a play! Holy crap, ladies and gentlemen, Randall Cobb. First career rushing touchdown. <laughs> they count that as a rush. <laughs> he juked him out. He's, oh my god. That's a highlight play if I've ever seen one right there, ladies and gentlemen. Look at them, they're all broke. That dude got shook. We just took the lead back. Man, oh man. That hurts good. 28-21 Dallas. We get, this is a fun game. I mean, I know I'm stressed out with the, the it being a tight game, but man, we're having fun. Man, oh man. Play of the game right there, maybe, y'all. Time stamp it. Those of you that stayed and you actually watched that play, watch that crap. Time stamp it. Let me know what y'all thought of that. I think we kind of got lucky. Y'all can all agree with me. We got lucky on it, but hey. Sometimes that's the way the game goes. We got lucky with it. Ooh. Wide open left side and the comeback route. Hey, Sean Jeffrey. Oh, it's going to cover one. You're just torching us in the air. Ground game. Oh, nothing happening for you, sir. Jalen Smith was coming through that gap untouched. Second and 13 on the cover six here. Moving the ball on the ground. Yeah, so much for halftime adjustment. Sometimes the best adjustment you make is no adjustment. You just do things better. And a toe drag, you got it. Five yard game. They may have to change up. They start to Aguilar. Third down and eight. Empty backfield here. Out of the gun. Big play. Another drag, and he's stopped by Shane Ray, I think, right there. Yes. Good to stop the Dallas defense. That prevented the first down. The Cowboys force a punt out of the Eagle offense. Tavon is going to let that sail. The Cowboy offense will come back out onto the field after a uh, huh, surprise play we saw out of there from Randall Cobb. Pollard head for four. I call that play a success. A nice inside Ooh, run. This is looking like a good stretch play for Pollard here, man. Look at this. Give me the block, Alawai. First down, breaks a tackle. Pollard is down. Oh, no, no. With a hard run, he got hit pretty well. He he did. He took a lick there in that play. Dang. Wide open, Jason Witten caught. Cowboy first down. Go get it. Oh, did he catch it? Oh my God, what a play! That he almost had it. A bruised sternum. He's done for the day anyway, not for the year. Hopefully, it's just a bruise. Cooper almost made an outstanding play right there. Oh, oh, oh. Zeke. Yeah, that's a first down run for Zeke. That means Weber's going to get some chances today out there. Absolutely means that. First and 10 now at the 24. Cooper about had an outstanding play. Witten, another catch. First and 10 down to the seven yard line. Actually, first and goal at the seven yard line. Third catch for Witten on the day. That sets Dallas up pretty good. And Zeke's going to try to get him on the draw here. And he rolls forward for five. 
the four, and it brings up second and goal. We're gonna try the read option. Shoot, I should have kept it with Dak. I gotta get better with his reads, man. It's just such a quick moment. It's such a quick moment. It's difficult. Empty backfield here for. Back of the end zone to Michael Gallup. Let's go, touchdown. Woo. The offensive line gave me time to throw, and Gallup made the most of it. Huge play. 35-21. Oh, man. All right, we got a little breathing room now. Let's have a better defensive. We got to have a better defensive play here. And there's the knee. All right. So the Cowboys in a comfortable position here, leading by two scores. Let's see what the Eagles do in response. Oh, Covington. Under route, caught. Ooh. First down. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. First and 10 at the 36 yard line of the Eagles. Bringing the blitzer up the middle on the slant. It is batted down there by Brown. Staying with the man. Yeah, the comeback route got him. And he, oh, he dropped. I thought he fumbled it. I thought I thought he dropped. I thought he fumbled that. Ooh. Empty backfield here. Under route. Stood up at the tip of the Eagle Beach. Nothing going there. Fourth and two. Cowboys hold. And we'll get that football back. Let's go. And that will go out at the eight yard line. A pretty good punt. All right, here we go. First and eight from the goal line, pretty much. We're going to take this. And that's a bad play as we did not get edge. We did not protect the edge. They did. We lost a whole bunch right there. Oh, it's going to make it very tough for us. So we're just going to go with a pass. Just try to get us something, even though this could be a dangerous play. Go, Whitten. Got us back to the 10 at least. So third and eight. Caught by Witten again. Oh, he dropped it on the hit, and he is injured. He is down with an injury. Dad, gum it. Well, we got to pump that football away. Back from our own end zone, right there. And there it goes. It gets off. Not a good. A huge hit there from Jalen, or from uh, Lewis. All right, he's a bruised shoulder, so it's nothing too serious at all. Let's see if I'm going to stop. And wide open middle of the field. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Big play there. First and ten. On D. Play action. Right side. Oh, my God. Yes, hit him. Let's go. Let us go. Second sack for DeMarcus Lawrence on the day, continuing to add on to his record-breaking year. Continuing. And nope, not catch. Not a catch. All right, so a third and 16. 
empty backfield. Long verticals, honestly. Hot on the short route underneath at the 37 yard line. They're in field goal range here. Let's we'll see what they do with it. They're going to kick that field goal. We're going to see if they can make it. See if they can make it here. It's up and it looks good. And it is. So it's now 35 to 24. Dallas leads this thing. These kickers now used to be that a 50 plus yarder was cause for celebration. Now All right. seemingly automatic. Yeah, isn't it funny when we prepare for a game when you get the 35-24. It's interesting, isn't it? To find out they were all state quarterbacks, receivers, defensive backs, all state wrestlers. Oh, oh I stepped out. Dang it, man. Here we go. Here we go. Got a good run going there. Here All right, so here's Zeke's day. 8 of 41 to start with the touchdown since it's 6 of 21 and no touchdowns. Uh, but we're okay. That's not a decline. Shut your mouth, announcer. You don't know. And whew, wow. Massive hit from the linebacker Brown. Good lord. Second and 10. Good lord. Whoa. That was not to him, by the way. He stole that ball from Gallup. I'm glad he did because it caught it was a catch nonetheless. Alright. Um, we always talk about having to read defense. Let's go back to the right side here of the run. Well, this was an excellent read. Read the pressure and get rid of the football before it even got to him for a nice game. Zeke, good run ahead. That's the last play of this third quarter right here, y'all. As the Cowboys lead this thing heading to the fourth, 35 to 24. Uh, our starters will finish out this offensive series. If we finish it with a touchdown, they will be done for the rest of this day. Uh, that should be good, in my opinion. And I just threw it away. Threw it away. That's okay. I kind of had a few options. You're right. Third and three. Caught by Coop. First down, Dallas. 16 to 22. Dak Prescott on the day, 251 yards. Ooh, baby. We're looking at you, Witten, on this play. It's worked before. Let's see if it works again. Got it off. Like Jarwin. Man, that play's good. That's such a solid play. 24 yard catch down into the 10 yard line now for the Cowboy offense. And here we go. And Zeke just bulldozes over the secondary defender for a Cowboy touchdown. Holy crap. Wow. Look at this. <laughs> Laid the wood on him. That's it for them. The starters are about to go sit. We're about to go sub them out real quick. And uh, that's excellent. That makes me very happy to see. All right, let's go ahead and get to this depth chart. Uh, Dak, your day is done. I mean, as far as I'm concerned, you're the third string quarterback behind him. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Okay. Uh, Cooper, I hesitate to keep you even in there. Noah Brown, even. Okay. Witten, I want Jarwin to play a little bit more. Dalton Schultz as well. Uh,. The O-linemen don't really get hurt too much. Defensively, we're keeping everybody strong. Just to ensure nothing crazy happens here as we lead by almost 20. Start off the fourth quarter. Feels good, man. Feels good to beat up on the Eagles a little bit. Makes my heart happy. I'm glad. All right, we're just going to keep in the man coverage right now until they prove they can beat us consistently. They'll probably go a lot of slant and come back on us, but we'll see. Or drag routes. And there's the comeback. Oh, and Awuzie was just a little late. He saw it coming, couldn't get in front of it. 
That was about to be a pick right there, Carson. You got lucky. You got very lucky on that comeback route. Empty backfield. And he missed him. It's 26 of 39. What do you take from this game offensively? Well, you know it's tough to really analyze for them because it is a team single, game, single, right? Single, Let's single. be honest, though. The defense is doing no favors in this one at all. Offense actually moved the ball. And Crawford on for the user sack, his first tackle and sack of the day. Getting his chance, 15th tackle this year. He hadn't done a lot this year. It's just because these formations, a lot of defensive tackles fill in these spots. Like Covington and Hill. Oh, high snap. They're going with the draw. And not going to happen. Not, not going to happen for you, Smallwood. I, I'm sorry. I, I value and I, I, you know, I applaud your effort. That ain't going to happen. Dude. Fourth and 12. And I've stopped up. My allergies are killing me. I probably sound a little different. My nose is like completely blocked. Oh, wow. Well, that's incomplete. Dallas offense to take the field, led by our backups. <laughs> Here's the White and Weber, Gallup, Schultz, Jarwin. Oh, boy. Sorry, Weber. Nothing good coming from that one right there. Well, oh man, I couldn't get over his head. White couldn't get it over the head. That's okay. Third and 11. Wow, you suck, White. Absolutely awful. Wide open. I even have my feet set and you missed him. So that's a 53 yarder. The intensity of the game in pregame. Great coverage there all around. Really didn't have many options. To throw the Bang. Up. Going to be completed every and season. good. 45 24. Cowboys extend their lead even further. Having a blast. And now it's all about ball control, isn't it? That's fielded in the end zone. All right, so the Dallas defense will take the field again. Trips tight on the right in the bunch. Play it here, Heath. And Heath on for the tackle there. And just so you all know, I always get these comments from people that are being like little turds in the comment section. They're like, you clearly never played football, GoBot. You make terrible decisions and play call stuff. Well, yeah, uh, that's a gimmick. If you don't like it, you don't have to watch. There's other people that have played football that have content like this. Go watch them. I don't care. I, I appreciate the people that are loyal, that are true to this channel, and that just they love to watch the content regardless if, if I make smart decisions or not. Because uh, some of you recognize I'm just a big Dallas fan. I'm a, I'm a gamer. I love Madden. Um, I'm a basketball coach, for goodness sake. So basketball is a little bit different from football in every aspect of the game. But, uh, you know, just get that out of here. I mean, I'm not about that nonsense of just throwing shade at people just for the sake of trying to get a comment. Because I'm not going to comment to you if you're being ugly. I'm not even going to comment. I'm just going to freaking mute your butt and block you. Get you out of here. Uh, I say that because I'm just, I just checked my phone on the comment section on a prior video and somebody's being that way. Just a helpful reminder of what we're about here at this channel. We're not about negativity. We're about positivity and a good uplifting message and you know, good criticisms, not being a jerk. We're trying to use nice, kind words. <laughs> Second and 10, 7.30 left. Cowboys still up, 45-24. What are we going to do? We're going to roll him out there? Okay. I still remember seeing the looks of disbelief on John Sanford. Make a third down. Thorson still in the game since uh, Carson Wentz went down with that injury. Third and two. Oh, wow, whiffed. 
Well, did he get it? No, he didn't, but they're going to go for it here. They're going to go for it here. The critical one here, if they're going to have any shot at this thing. So they'll go for it on fourth down. On fourth down, it's Thorson. Oh, wow. Touchdown. Wow. Good play, y'all. Oh, good play. 46 passes to 14 rushes. Holy crap. That's what happens when you're playing from behind the whole game. It's a flag. Oh, what? Who did that? Jordan Lewis, why would you do that, dude? Well, well they're going to kick it way through the upright. That's all right. We'll take the personal foul. So out comes the Dallas offense once again. 45, whatever is the lead. We're going to go left side here with Weber. We'll try to get a good run here. Weber shakes off one. Nothing else going to your game. At least he's in the positives. Weber again, patient run, three yards ahead. And Zeke's in the game, y'all. Pass interference. Cobb still caught it. Holy crap, dude. All up on his back. Somehow there's not a flag on that play, but whatever. We'll take the catch. Wow. That was an unbelievable play. Ah. Got two. Second and seven from the 48 yard line of the Dallas. Overthrew him. Heavy pressure, inaccurate. Rolling down the safety. Well, look at White go. <laughs> oh, 13 yard scramble. I'll take that all day. That's fantastic. Fan freaking fantastic. Uh, Weber ahead. No gain. Second and 10 from 39 of the Eagles Witten in the game for Dallas. And Witten with another outstanding catch. Holy crap. And dude is just a stud out there. Two minute warning coming up now for Dallas. And uh, we're going to look to put up a 50 spot in this Eagles defense. Not a very good defensive game. Not a lot happening in that area. Uh, but we're, we're living it up, man. Live it up. Oh, Weber. That's all right. It's all right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. With a minute 56 to go. Officially nothing on that last run. They'll try again second and 10. That one looks like he'll throw here. And nothing opened up for me. Third and 15. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh, I want to win power. Right, here we go. Caught and dropped. What's the call? What's the flag? Shoot. Well, that's going to be a uh, decline. That hold coming from the left side of the line. Whoa. Never mind. It's not declined. What a stupid decision by them. Now that gives me a chance to get more. Why would they decline that? <laughs> Whatever. Gives me another chance. And Witten does. Oh my god. Why did he drop it? 
He dropped it. <sighs> Fourth down. We're going for it. I don't care. The game's done. I'm just trying to. And we had the fourth quarter glitch anyway. Oh, man. A Dak in the game, and he almost made a touchdown throw there on the punt fake. Or the, 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 the fake right there, man. That's okay. Well, this is it, y'all. The last minute and a half of the game. We're having a little fun with it, obviously, out there. 30, 31 to 45, Cowboys lead. You catch that or is that out of bounds? Okay. Very good. The incomplete it was. Oh, he chopped my legs. On the slant. And a host of Cowboys on for that hit. Clock rolling now. And up. And another catch. Hurry up offense. Pressure. Fumble. Oh my god. Who's that? What? He caught the ball. That's not a. That's, get him again. Hit him again. Oh man. Keep going backwards, man. Idiot. Well, last play of the game probably coming here. Last two plays of the game. And incomplete. Thorson not having a great time out there right now, guys. He's all banged up back there. Especially after that deep, <laughs> horrific thing we just saw. Taking a shot. Let's go deep. Whoa. I don't like that camera angle. I got to switch that back. All right, we're just going to take the knee, fix the camera angle. So the Cowboys are going to leave with the win. It's 45-31 to 31 Cowboys, the victors here against the Eagles in Week 16. Now with our 13th win on the year, ladies and gentlemen. And weren't we good out there today? We were solid. Solid, solid, solid in all aspects. Defensively, yes, we struggled at times, but overall, y'all, that was just an outstanding game for us. Uh, keeps us right where we need to be in terms of number one seed. And we'll see if... Uh, so for Dallas, they can we'll see if anything changes up there. So the Cowboys got the big win there today. Uh, let's look at some of the key stats here. Mike Webb, nothing going. Gallup had nothing really going. But we'll look at those stats in the postgame show. But again, if you enjoyed this episode today here of the Cowboy franchise here at Madden 20, make sure to leave a huge thumbs up, ladies and gentlemen. Comment down below. Hit that notification bell so you know when I go live. And feel free to subscribe here to the channel as the Cowboys are now 13 and 2, and we'll get ready to do all these upgrades in the postgame show. But thanks so much for tuning in. Stay tuned for the postgame show, and I'll see you back here in the next video. Y'all take it easy.